welcome to the mysterious world of bats, part of Backyard Science Days at the Science Center. It's so much fun. Rob Miles is joining us live with more. And you have been in our studio before with these bats. I love them. Why are they so much fun? <laughs> Well, they're mammals, and they're the only mammals in the world that can fly. So they look a little bit like us. They have uh, fur, they have eyes, they have noses. They have babies, they have moms, Aww. they have friends. Uh, they're a lot like us. They're so cute. <laughs> tell, us, tell us a little so bit about- So I have two bats. Oh, sorry. Tell us a little bit about what people can expect when they come. Well, I'm on the stage right now um, in the uh, main lobby of the uh, Maryland Science Center, and we've got a great day today planned from noon to four for Backyard Science Days. We're going to be talking about these little bats right here that's in my hand. This is what our local bats, our Baltimore, our Maryland uh, bats look like. They're insect eaters, which is awesome because people, uh, we have a lot of insects, so mosquitoes and flies and gnats, and so bats flying around in our backyards are going to be so um, important for us. So people get a chance to see them. We talk about bat houses and how people could do something in their backyards. But one of the coolest things, at least for me, is that people get a chance to see the biggest oh, bat wow. in the world. Right yeah, here. He's awesome. What he kind of cool. a bat is this he? This is Camilla. Camilla, Camilla is 21 years old. Uh, it is the biggest species in the world. They have up to a six foot wingspan. Oh my gosh. Uh, she's a little tired. There, oh, yeah. there we go. Look at that. Oh, she's so cool. She's really cool. And she's been with you a long time. I so think Camilla the, uh, was people, the one that was here. Go ahead. No, no, no. I think she was the one that was here in our studio. That's she's, right. You, you've been with her a long time. Yep. Absolutely. I've worked with her for 17 years. I'm a bat expert of 25 years. One of the really great things about bats around the world is that they provide us a lot of ecological benefits. And fruit bats like this uh, spread seeds in the rainforest. Uh, and then there's also pollinating bats. Bats pollinate bananas, avocados, and even blue agave that we make tequila from is only pollinated by bats. Oh, bats are doing great things, and you are spreading the message so well. Thank you so much for joining us this morning. We could just look at Camilla and your other little bat all day long. Thanks for joining us this morning, Rob. <laughs>